Okay, I have to say I love I love Waffen VV. Like the lore is so deep. I love it. Remind <laughs> me of the lore. It's been uh, a hot minute. So last time um VV beat Waff uh, on the stream, VV uh screamed you're carried after he killed him with max rage at 40. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, that's... Wait, VV screamed that at, at Ralphie? Yeah, after he forward smashed Ralphie at 40% while he was at, like, 150. <laughs> and just killed him and said, you're carried. And stormed off. Uh, DQ'd himself from the tournament. <laughs> um, so, yeah. So, I, I love this. I love this. So, I mean, what do you think about this matchup, Lucario Wolf? Uh, well, I mean, I feel like Lucario, every matchup is basically, can you kill Lucario? Yeah. Uh, and Wolf can do that. So, mm -hmm. I mean, of course, if you can play around Wolf's kill options, it is very, very difficult. But if you're a Lucario player, you're just used to playing around kill options. So, he's going to Yeah, so, I mean I, I mean, I definitely agree with that, because it's like, Wolf, Lucario struggles, struggles against characters with, like, huge hitboxes, and Wolf has all of those. But then Vivi throws out forward smash with punishes like that, and that's why uh, Lucario is OD. I will say, Rafi as a player is, I feel like he doesn't kill early. You know, like he has more of a, you know, it's going to play safe and get consistent damage. Yeah, more methodical. As a, yeah, more methodical as opposed to YOLO, you know, just throw out the down smash in neutral. Yeah. Which a lot of wolves do. I, I could see, like, I, okay, I was about to say, like, down smash and forward smash. Um, Thing is, in this matchup, it's almost kind of free, because, you know, Lucario's, um, Recovery, uh, it can be susceptible to big hitboxes at the ledge. And uh, getting hit with that anti-air up tilt, because uh, try to be reverse R for your into him. You know, it's funny, because like Wolf, like, I, I love when Lucario tried to be reverse into people. They have a character like Wolf who just like presses the A button and it's just like hitbox. It's just like, what are you doing? <laughs> oh my god. See, bro, he, look, he's about to die. Who is? Beefy. He's just I'm pretty sure Ralphie's about to die, too. What are you doing, Ralph? You're making him stronger. Yeah. Oh, okay. I like I like what Ralphie just tried to do. Now the thing is that but earlier in the set, uh, Ralphie started going for a ton of back airs when he was at like back air kill percent. Because he's like, I'm not gonna damage you anymore. I'm just gonna hit you with the back air. And that was when BB got the forward smash on him. Yeah. And so if he I like this idea of going more for Nairs, actually trying to go for uh, Killing him off the ledge, and oh my god, yeah. 113 since when? Ooh, like, yeah, Ralphie's is going for like, quicker hits and fast, uh, bigger hitboxes and faster buttons. Uh, the back air is a big button, but it's kind of slow that it comes out. But with that being said, it still outranges that aura sphere. And yeah, this is kind of one of the problems with Lucario, where if you don't take that stock, like, how do you actually retaliate, you know? Especially because he lost his aura sphere, confirms. It's just. You know this. You know. You know. For most characters, this is a, this could be like a discouraging position, but honestly, for Lucario, uh, it's not that bad. And now we're pretty much at an even game, and VV has the high percent, so they're pretty much at even. This is something that Lucario kind of wants. Ooh, that was a good job covering the counter, and now 97, 107 goes oh, for that hard read. And I like it. Good tech away, and it was a safe, you know, safe option by uh, Ralphie. Yeah, okay, this is the ledge trapping that Lucario can kind of suffer from. Uh, he doesn't exactly, he doesn't have the fastest buttons. Yeah, Wolf is just, so, so many big hitboxes, it makes it hard for Lucario to kind of maneuver around. We have to kind of, kind of take gambles. Like, Vivi just did there, took that gamble and contested that back air and, you know, got some net some 35%. Yeah. And I have to say, like, I love the the neutral airs from Ralphie because they are, it's this fast aerial, and it pretty much prevents Vivi from going into the air because Vivi's moves are significantly less fast. And even if he does, like, short hop forward air, which I believe, besides down air, is as fast as aerial, mm -hmm. it's kind of just going to lose to Wolf Nair. Yeah, um, yeah, Wolf Nair's big hitbox, kind of like a short hitbox. And the thing about that is you see how Vivi avoided the ledge. Because, like, he, A, you don't want to be on the ledge against Wolf, right? It's very hard to get off. B, there's a chance that Wolf could throw out a big hitbox and Lucario could get messed up. Because, you know, um, Lucario, when he recovers like that, like, he lingers a little bit there at the ledge. So it's like, you know, both of us, he's trying to, he was trying to bank on going past Wolf. So, you know, get Ralphie to flinch a little bit. Ralphie wasn't going for it. Scoop him up with that L smash. All right, game two. Is that Town and City? Is that what I'm seeing? Yes. Yep. That's it. Now, what are your thoughts on the stage count? Yeah, I mean, I agree with it. Um, so it's like, in this version of town, the height is bigger. 
is, I mean, it's, it's taller. Uh, so it's like, you're not going to die off the top as easy. So Lucaro being somewhat of a heavy character and Wolf killing off the top a lot, uh, I, you know, I believe in this pick. It's a good counter pick. And, um, you know, right now, uh, you know, Soul Star for both players is kind of filling each other out. And Ralphie, you know, getting the better of Vivi in these exchanges because Wolf's range. Oh, goes for a hard read. I do like the idea behind it. I think that Ralphie going, at the very least, make him a little scared, you know? Yeah. Put fear in him because he's already pressured to, like, get something started. And then if he's also scared about, like, what if he just <laughs> randomly forward smashes? <laughs> that that upbeat was hilarious, mostly because he, he kind of whiff punished Ralphie for that. And, you know, the thing about Vivi in this matchup, he's looking for a lot of knockdowns, right? Because... No way. Oh, oh yeah. my god, that almost killed him. What Lucario lives lives for is stray hits into Lucario anything. Yeah, and that's also what I mean. Like, Ralphie can sometimes oh. struggle to kill. Sometimes he'll have, like, the kill setup, yeah. but he goes for a more guaranteed punish. Yeah. Like, right there, Lucario or a Sears in the wrong direction. He probably could have gotten turned around, down, smash. Something. In time. Maybe for a tilt. Yeah, but he went for the grab. And against Lucario, if he gives you the chance to kill him, you need to take it. Yeah, because right now he's at a deficit. Yeah, I, I actually missed it. I went to look you in the, in the eyes to tell you that, and all of a sudden... Oh, is that... That's not death, though. Yeah, Wolves just cannot kill with throws if it's not back throw. Although back throw, I feel like, eh, doesn't... Yeah. Um, and Ralphie's securing that stock, and, you know, it's not very good for Vivi because he didn't net a lot of percent off of that um, when he could have done it in right with Rage. Okay. Nice parry by Ralphie. Yeah, and I think Ralphie's catching on to um, some of Vivi's aerial approaches. Because Vivi does a lot of narrow approaches. Just, just try to knock Vivi down and get tech chases. Knock Ralphie down and get tech chases. Oh, wow. And that back air to finish it. Honestly, that stock was just played perfectly by Ralphie. Yeah. Just consistently got damage and then just found his, like, you know, went for the kill move. The relatively safe kill move of back air. Um... And now it's uh, this is Vivi already. It's, this is game two, you know. Like yeah. you cannot. There is no more room to fall back on. This is just winner's stock right here. And Lucario, of course, can do it. Oh yeah. Lucario can do anything he puts his mind to. Yeah. This this really isn't the worst scenario for Lucario, to be honest, right? Like maybe it was two stocks. Number one stock down. Um, not that bad. Really, it really isn't. I'm also loving the patience from Ralphie. Like, look at him. Like, he he was like just not approaching, not approaching, and then the single down air that BB threw out, he was in there immediately and managed to punish him. Yeah, I'm, I really like how he's picking his spots. Right, like he's not rushing in. He's being very patient, waiting for waiting for BB to throw a laggy up so he could retaliate. And you know, not because thing is, you could jump into Luc Lucario things and just die. Like, honestly, picking your spots is exactly the right way to put it. And uh, <laughs> as we say that, he gets hit by forward smash. Yeah. I mean, he was picking his... Oh, Ooh, no. got the knockdown. Oh, yeah. God. I thought he was going to die somehow. Yeah, this is oh, not a what? bad position no. for Vivi. Don't... Okay. Oh, my God. Wolf up smash would not kill right now, right? Oh, uh, yeah, it might kill. Could kill. Now could now definitely kill. Yeah, uh, and that up tilt is definitely going to trade. Isn't up tilt strong enough smash? I heard that song. Oh, oh my god. Oh no. Oh my god. Oh no. <laughs> I don't know what happened. It looked like he dropped shield at the very last moment. I thought he spot dodged. Um, something happened. Uh, it looked like he dropped shield spot dodged. He tried to do something. Whatever had happened didn't work. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it was a spot dodge. Spot dodge and... Oh, yeah. yo, you're right. He dropped. He tried to parry it. Yeah, he tried to parry, but oh, I his shield was smaller than normal. Yeah, and he tried Is to parry it, it and he might have expected something else. He he might have he either tried to roll because Ralphie looks confused, so I don't think he tried to parry. He might have tried to roll away. He might have just tried to immediately roll away and got caught like on his initial startup frame of roll by the forward. All right. Smash. So what do you think? If Vivi wins, what do you think he's gonna? What he's I don't gonna think he's gonna, gonna pop up. I think he got all that out of the system. If he pops up again, I will. We need to clip that for the for the culture. <laughs> so. Oh. Yeah, and Ralphie's starting out fast um, as usual. I mean, they both got three hits, and it just happens to be that one of their one of the characters does like 17 per hit, and the other one. And, did I, and I like that follow up, that up air to that nair follow up, just dragging Ralphie down to the floor. Ooh, okay. 
Yeah, and Ralphie looks like he's getting a little hasty now. Yeah, no, that, I mean, how can you not? It's losing game two like that. Yeah. Can, it, it's so easy to beat yourself up, and Ralphie can be a very emotional player. Yeah. Yeah, and right now, you know, VB's just do you're doing his normal game plan. Um, trying to drift into Ralphie, get a mix up. Uh, Ralphie, you know, off that start, you know, is getting it, getting it together a little bit, slowing it down. Ooh, okay. So yeah, Ralphie just tried to scoop him up uh, out of that uh, B reverse aura sphere with up smash because that that scoops. Dude, is that he... enough? The back <gasps> he smashes out. I think he could have done it. I think it would have killed him outright. I mean, Lucario is deceptively heavy, but. He's a happy boy, but it doesn't right. matter anyway. And to air him with that up air. I was a little bit worried about Rafi, whether he could shake it off and, you know, get back to his form, but it seems that he has taken that first stock, and let's see if he plays that sort of, you know, picking the right places. Whether he does that again and manages to actually get a lead. Of course, a lead doesn't mean he wins, as yeah. we have seen. But it, a lead is better than no lead. Yeah, Wolf, Wolf, Wolf is a character that can carry a lead really well. Um... He can make it very fresh ring for you to get in and um, wall you out with his aerials and projectiles. This is really annoying. So. I like the adaptation though, where Rafi is sort of doing that same, you know, oh, I'm gonna try to like, you know, weave in and out of your stuff. You know, just like pick, pick my places carefully. And the adaptation, the adjustment from Vivi was to go for a lot more tricky movement with the B reverses and the wave bounces, and that should be it. Yeah, yeah, death yeah. Death. Yeah, caught, yeah, caught him shielding a little bit too long. Um, you know, with that being said, you know, uh, VB's at 85%, which means it's time to work. <laughs> it's time to work for Lucario, man. But let's see if Ralph is going to let him play, because he might just end this stock a little bit early. Ooh, oh. and narrowly missing <laughs> Ralphie. And he's down airing his shield like that. I don't agree with that. Oh, Ooh, oh. Not the, I mean, he's not getting punished for anything. Oh man, that down smash almost did it. Ooh, and yeah, and Ralphie with the patience, just waiting for Vivi to jump and throwing out those well placed back airs at a safe range. Vivi didn't know how to get around it. Oh, that was so good from Ralphie, just waiting and managing to get the forward air punish. Two hits of neutral air connected. Yeah. Uh, still safe on hit at, at that percent, so. We try to cast that rolling with the Aura Sphere. I out. think he was hoping he'd for a missed attack. <gasps> oh, okay, he got the missed attack that he wanted, not fast enough. Yeah, I mean, that's all. That's what Vivi's trying to do right now, just get a knockdown. Get a knockdown, and <laughs> it's time to play. Uh, but right now, he's not He's not winning. He's yeah, not winning. and then as soon as he goes in for something a little bit more committal, that's when Ralphie manages to punish all effectively. You know, I wonder if Ralphie's going to try to call out one of those Aura Spheres with Reflector. I wonder if that's something he that hasn't done it once. Yeah, that's that's that that's like an end of the but set if finisher. If you notice, like the range is <gasps> where. Oh, he tried to parry it again. That was definitely a parry attempt. Yeah. That was not a poke whatsoever. Ooh, that oh. DI was a little suspect. <laughs> well, Ralphie. Oh no. It's all up no. to you, kid. You, okay, we even went for the back air for some reason. Okay. Oh man. Oh yeah. Ralphie oh, trying no. to bait him with that forward smash. <gasps> Ooh. I feel like Ralphie could have ended it right there, but he goes for the safe. No, instead. Smash Deck would have got him punished. <laughs> okay, yeah. Okay, let's see what VB does here. Oh, and VB called that out. <gasps> okay, oh, yeah. just the back throw. No back throw? Oh, and VB with the high recovery, not playing with Man. the ledge right now. Oh, fantastic job with the up tilt. And I mean, at that point, when Ralphie is like not really throwing out any options, it's and Wolf has so many kill options, mm -hmm. it's hard to figure out which one he's actually really sort of aiming for. We hadn't seen the up tilt really for a long time. Vivi just sort of forget about it, approaches with this Ooh, and that air. dash back, that yeah. dash back was so good. Because all Vivi, Vivi, all Vivi's going to fish for is to knock down in that situation, right? Because um, that's the one way he's going to win, get a knockdown. And Mario Party time starts, like, <laughs> like honestly. But um, good stuff by Ralphie, just not getting baited into what you know Vivi's trying to do there, just uh, playing his own game and just kicking him in the face. So.